Coming to you live, it's the hottest, loudest, most dangerous television show on the planet. Pull up a chair, pop open that beer, and get yourself ready. Everybody, come on in. It's time for Tommy's Garage. With your host, Tommy Atkins. Your mechanics, Rosie Rosencrantz. Senorita Fuego. Houston comedian and filmmaker, Joey Tirado. And the chocolate thunder himself, Gavin Babineau. With special guests, Houston comedians Mike Rao and Tim Mathis. I'm Matthew, the voice Gidry. Welcome to Tommy's Garage. Yeah! 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 Everybody welcome to Tommy's Garage! Yeah! You guys ready for a great show tonight? Yeah! Yeah! We got one for you, but we got to meet the Tommy's Garage Mechanics. You guys will meet the Tommy's Garage Mechanics, right? Yes, yes, yes. All right. He's kind of a big deal, especially if you're counting cowboy hats. Oh. It's Rosie Rosencrantz. Rosie! 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 I'm not a conspiracy theorist. But the hell you are. The hell you are. Do you know what it is? It's 420 today. Happy 420. Come on, come on. Save the weed. Free the weed. Oh, man. I, never saw, I didn't see that one coming. What a burn. Whoa, man. Joey spent a lot of time working on that, didn't he? Yeah. She's coming. In many ways, don't let me explain that considering our FCC guidelines. It's see you need the fuego. Yeah. No, that's the leader. And he's kind of a big deal. I bet Tipper Girl watches his TV show on Amazon Prime every night and dreams about him. It's Joey Toronto. Yeah. I love you so much. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> the big news, the big news. Bill O'Reilly is out. Yet, wow. um, yet another woman complained that O'Reilly was hitting on her. Fox and O'Reilly got tired of each other, and now he's gone, Rosie. Yeah, so if I call Gavin hot chocolate, will I be fired from Tommy's garage? Yes, yes. Oh my God, yes. Okay, O'Reilly said, don't worry about me. He'll be fine. He's, he's, he's made millions of dollars over the years. He's wrote lots of books over the years. And all the hot, smoking hot, doable are leaving anyway over there. So he's, he's, he's a, yeah, that's a anyway. good point, Rosie. Yeah. <laughs> and they're giving him $25 million right. to not come back. At, you know, at least, point. at least. I, 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 I think he's more worried about the doable not there anymore. <laughs> I, I, quit, I quit for like $1,000. So. <laughs> Speaking of 1000 Tommy. <laughs> we don't even get to it. I know. I know. I know what's up with that. <laughs> so, Sorry. I'm broke. So, <laughs> so, is he a jerk? Yeah, he looks like he's a jerk. Uh, does he have to wave his winner around like Anthony Winner? Oh, no. No, he doesn't have the right to do that. But I know that a lot of these women of these networks are willing to do anything and suck their way all the way up to the top, and then when they're on the top, on the top in many ways, they start <laughs> crying sexual harassment. So guess what? They right deserve there. each other! <laughs> That's three big bells. Yeah. I've been there, seen that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Fuego, can, I, you go, can you go back to the uh, on the top stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you like, I see I'm Joey's sorry. dream disappearing Joey's in front of Joey's got chubby right now. <laughs> All right, back to the show. It looks like um, the uh, no spin zone has suddenly become the no broadcast zone. Oh, oh that's a hammer right yeah, there. And, you know, it looks like also it's kind of after years of frustration and disappointment, it looks like the New York Times finally got their man. Yeah, 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 it took yes. him a while, but they yeah. did it. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. How it's dare real. he you know, yeah. hit on a chick? Yeah. Like, yeah. Look, let's look at the dead list for Fox here. Megyn Kelly, <laughs> Greta Van Susteren, Glenn Beck, Andrea Tanteros, who, by the way, if you go on her on her uh, Twitter, she's like three-quarters of the way, she's wearing bathing suits that hardly exist. She's popping out all over, and then she...
is about being sexually harassed on TV. It's like, please. Um, Gretchen Carlson, Rudy Bakhtar, who didn't go show up, and Bill O'Reilly. Hey, Fox, right here. Tommy's Garage. That's right. That's yeah. right. Yeah. That's right. Yes. Gut, what's what Gutfeld's already stealing from us. You might as well, you know, bring in the best on board. What the hell, right? Yeah, replace O'Reilly with Tommy's Garage. That's, that's what we're right. saying. There you go. That, that's, that's the show you guys should have on that's Fox right there. Right. Well, seems like the one place you can find more bloodshed than the Fox News headquarters is a Donald Trump rally. This yeah. week, all over America, Trump supporters held rallies. So did leftist thugs. Let's see who won. Ooh, Ooh he smacked that, didn't he? Yeah. Yes, he did. Like, something interesting happened, Rosie. Trump supporters fought back and won. Yeah. Hey, moly locks. <laughs> you're, you're lucky you just got punched out by make they were making impro improvised grenades and throwing grenades. <coughs> She's lucky all she got was punched out. That's right, yeah, absolutely. Molly Locks needs to go to prison for a long time. Woo! Oh, I like that one. <laughs> Little tenderizer moment right there. These sorrows and abomination thugs. I have six words. Bump the spit out of them! Yeah, yeah. I like that one. <laughs> That's six. That's six, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Joey went to school, apparently. Yeah, this Don't is not say like one word. Is this algebra for you or something? Hey, I just counted them on my fingers, and it was six. That's, yeah. that's how I say it. That's the way I stood. Anyway, as the legendary. Why are you looking at me hey. like that? I it's, hard to, it's hard to take my eyes off you, Fuego. He always looks at you like that. Yeah. It's, it's He's undressing you with his eyes. Yeah. Like he does every time he sees you. Don't I worry, got the best chair. I got, I, 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 oh, I got, yes. So don't worry about it. Get opportunity, whore. But um, as the legendary uh, baseball player and manager Yogi Berra said, it's deja vu all over again with these these protesters. Can't we just stun them with our Star Trek phasers and then send them to a, a Mars penal colony or colony or something? That's the word I want. Colony. Why don't we just beat their more yeah. fun. Come on. Yeah, there's one. Deeper. There's one I thing suppose. missing here. Hey, man, one, there's one thing missing oh, from, from all the all these. Anybody know what it is? The police. Yes. Yeah. They so, watched. They were so ordered to stand down. Down. A left-wing reporter was yeah. watching all the Trump protesters beat down the commies. So he went to the cops and he asked them a couple questions. Check this out. You guys been hanging back today. Doing our job. What's your job? I mean, there's been people brawling all day long. Just letting it go. Not at liberty to discuss. Hey, how come you guys are hanging back? Not at liberty. <laughs> I'm high. Hey, I'm high. I mean, I haven't seen the cops around. People are just like beating the shit out of each other. Public statement, right? Uh, no, I'm just asking you guys. I mean, you're here. I would defer you to our public information officer. <laughs> so they you to hang back. Great That's a guy's four. Yeah, he's, he's been in a lawsuit or two. What's your next question? I mean, I'm just watching, Are you high, officer? I've been, I've been watching all day. People get, get, you know, beat up pretty bad. I haven't seen you guys around much. Mm -hmm. Okay. And? and? Ah! That's what you were waiting for. That's what you were waiting for. Now, here's, here's what happened. This is in Berkeley. It's the Berkeley police who are as communist as, as, as all San Francisco yes. is, right? The last time they had a riot there, the, 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 the communists were beating up, up the Trump supporters. So the chief of police said, well, this time, let it happen again. He didn't realize this time the Trump supporters fought back and they were beating the, the, the communist asses. So that, the next time, and, he, and this poor commie's like, oh, we're getting beaten. Well, how come you guys aren't helping us? Where was he, where was he the last time that, that they were beating the Trump people up? Nowhere, right. So, by the way, this never happens in Texas. Why? Because we will shoot your communist ass <laughs> where I live. That's what I said. Sell myself for that one. <clears throat> Meanwhile, down the road a few miles in L.A., this happened. Uh, let me read uh, your tweet from this morning. This is the most recent tweet from the Maxine Waters Twitter account. The president is a liar. His actions are contemptible. And I'm going to fight every day until he's impeached. What are the impeachable offenses, Congresswoman? You just started that by saying the question becomes, should we wait to call for impeachment and, until we have the answers to that question? Or well, some of the I questions? Not, I have not called for impeachment. Oh, you said I'm going to fight every day until he's impeached. That's what you tweeted. Yeah, but here's what I've said. <laughs> yeah. 30 seconds in between one and the other one. Yeah, yeah Rosie, liberalism means never having to admit you're wrong. Is she still alive? I thought Dorothy's house fell on her years ago. <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey slap, slappy maxi pad oh. is, a, is a disgusting sack of bones 
with red lipstick and a bad, bad, bad James Brown wig. Oh, that's like <laughs> hammer, tenderizer, bell. You got everything on that one. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? When you are lying, disgusting sucker bones with a bad wig and a lipstick, <laughs> We understand that, but if you're stupid and ugly too, you have to jump from a bridge. Yeah. Not your pants. <laughs> Hello. All right, two. Hey, hey, fuego. <clears throat> two things about uh, Maxine Waters. Okay, the first one is she's from California, which is a, that sums it all up. A beautiful yeah. state that can't elect somebody who doesn't have uh, grape jello for brains. And the second thing is she's 157 years old. So let her serve the milk and cookies, but you know, keep away from the legislation. Right there. Thank you. <laughs> Look, for 25 years, the last, last 25 years, whatever you say, it's on the internet instantly right. and right. forever. Right. You say something stupid, it's on the internet forever. And if you're ugly, <laughs> you're ugly on the internet forever. forever. And if you're stupid, ugly, and an idiot, and you're Your time is gone. Your time is gone. Forever, <laughs> Maxine. I Look, I don't know who caught this, but a kid totally photobombed CNN this week. Everybody see this? There's no comments. Yeah, no kind of in stark relief, the juggling act that every president yeah. has to do in, in taking questions on North Korea as the tensions rise there and presiding over, as I said, the least tense. Now, watch what this kid says. But I, I picked it up. I blew it up. Watch what he says. Watch me. He's, 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 he's miming something. Yeah. Yeah, kind of in stark relief, the juggling act that every president has to do in, in taking questions on North Korea as the tensions rise there and presiding over, as I said, the least tense uh, or should be right. of presidential. What, ha what, what happened was the, the, the kid was mining <clears throat> uh, fake news. Yeah. Ah! Fake news. <laughs> so, anyway, look. So, here, so, here's my question. So, so, yes or no answer, simple as that. By the way, North Korea attacked the United States yesterday with a movie. You guys see this? Yes. yes. Check and look. Here we go. <clears throat> That's New York City, right? Yep. Uh oh. He wants to wipe New York City up. <laughs> All right, I got a quick question. I just want a yes or no answer. Is anything going to happen to Korea this week? Yes. Yes. What do you think, Rosie? What's going to happen? Oh, they're going to bomb the shit out of them. <laughs> See you at the fuego. What's going to happen? I, I don't think anything is going to happen. You know why? Because the crazy fat kid took this week off to eat. <laughs> that was a yes or no answer. Joey, give me a yes. <laughs> no, nothing, nothing's going to happen. Those guys got to learn how to party. I mean, haven't they learned anything from Charlie Sheen yet? Oh. Oh. Yeah. I say no. Apparently, Fat Boy's taking a family to four after dinner, and he's going to eat them. So, look, that's it for the news. Matt gives you what's coming up, buddy. Later on, we have Senorita Fuego and the Bigot Lottery. But next, it's time for Worldwide Panic, it's only on Tommy's Garage. Yes! You locked your deadbolt, but this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need Armor City doors. There were over 1 million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, Armor City doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539. Or stop by ArmorCityDoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins. But when deadbolts fail, you need Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com. <laughs>
healthcare system, broken. The FDA, broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. to prove the world is sailing into the future. Still looking for the evidence. Joining us is Mr. Chocolate Thunder, Gavin Babano! Gavin! Hello, hello. That was smooth, like always. Yeah. In Britain, speaking of babies, a big study was just released. It shows crying babies reduce your income by 11%. That's a lot of money, Rosie. Yeah, so this means a lot of parents lost a lot of money in November after the November election. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of money. I like that. <laughs> I just think that if Hillary, Hillary's uh, parents were alive, they would be flat broke today. Yeah. <laughs> she probably ate them. Oh, what? she keeps whining. I think she ate them. Okay. So, oh, <laughs> Gavin. That's I like, mean, have oh. you seen those cankles? They're disgusting. Oh! oh. <laughs> I'm just saying. And she calls them mom and dad. Yeah. <laughs> so, the best solution here on out, you walk into Bed Bath & Beyond. You go to the Beyond section, there's a special blue remote control. Mute the children and fast forward them until they're about 21 when you can all have beer oh, and just chill. Gavin, okay? if you nice. could do that, <laughs> not, yeah. you get the <laughs> biggest belt in world history is what you would get. You're rich and Bill Gates. <laughs> busy tomorrow. Just yeah. ask Christopher Walken. You have to fast forward that until they're about um, 40. I mean, I know I crossed my, parent, my parents' millions, I'm sure. No kidding. Like in New Zealand, a thief broke into a woman's house and stole everything that was in the freezer. Steaks, burgers, vegetables, and the Intestines. placenta from her son's birth. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yummy, Rosie. Uh, yeah, well, first of all, what's the expiration date on frozen placenta? <laughs> <laughs> and, and wait a minute, and what wine do you serve with placenta? It's printed right. on the back of the baby's wine. head, okay? Oh, placenta? But you know what? It could have been worse. You know, she could have had Taco Bell. Oh! <laughs> oh, nasty fuego. Oh, nasty. very true. <laughs> Total and very oh, true. So... <laughs> You mean you don't like Taco Bell? I love it. I knew it. Can you tell? I yeah. knew it. I knew it. Okay, so. You got a lifetime commitment. <laughs> my question is what the hell was this guy thinking? What the hell? If I were going to do this, I would have called it, you know, like, like a nice recipe, pre planned this, like placenta salad, placenta. <laughs> no, no, no. Ba bear with me. Placenta kebabs, placenta and potatoes. I'm not going to do the stupid accent from Forrest Gump, but I think if you if you were going to do this, you should plan it and make it really fun. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah, placenta and onions. I haven't had that in years. Hey, it's better than liver and onions, right? Right. Oh. Just don't deep fry it. That's what I'm saying. Look, you know, my, my mom kept my foreskin in the freezer. Oh, right. Then one day she, she defrosted it, turned it into a pot roast. Yeah. <laughs> that must have been a small pot roast. Yes or no? <laughs> no. no. All right. I'm Thanks Thanks the the Where's that bomb, Brandon? Brandon? Bomb! Thanks for the tip. Here we go. <laughs> oh, no! Two in one show! Not the oh. crickets. Not, not the crickets. crickets. Not the crickets. <laughs> They're about as big yeah, as the crickets. I'd rather have the plane than the crickets. Oh. In Mexico. <laughs> but everybody left anyway. Then they gave me a bomb. Thanks a lot. Yeah. yeah. In Mexico City, feminists claim 90% of women who travel using the subway have been sexually harassed. 90%. So they set up a new program to fight the sexual harassment. Wiener seats. <laughs> yeah. They make subway seats that look like a naked man, including the family jewels, and the sign says, reserved for men, Rosie. Yeah, yeah well, they're nutless, so they must be married men. Oh. <laughs> There's no nuts on them. That's a good, good point. 
quick. I just gotta say that depends on the size of the seat. First of all, <laughs> and second of all, you're right. They designed that from Matthew's back. Oh. Oh. I, I, I like where you're going. Correct the yes. math. But I like where you're going. Man, I like where this is going. <laughs> I absolutely agree. Matt. Yeah, I thought that they needed to use a better mold. However, <laughs> see, he got that. Yeah. However, however. Because this was such a waste of money, why won't they just give the women these electrified vaginal tongue. inserts? That way, when they do get raped, the ending will be a real shocker. Oh, oh man! That'll stop them. That'll stop them. That's the thing I ever heard. That will show. stop the problem. No, yeah, yeah, no that, that will stop. Lim- they get, probably get more riders on it too. <laughs> well, whatever, whatever you do, whatever you do, don't put a vagina on the seats. So some guys will never leave the train. Yes. Yeah. They'll never get off the train. You know what I mean? Gavin's right. uh, Let's clean this up a little bit, <laughs> please. Let's clean this up a little bit. In Japan, a classy guy. Look at this guy. 82-year-old Shigeo Takuda. He looks like quite the gentleman, right? But he has a secret. He's the king of elderly porno. Yes. That's right. That's a man I respect. How does he still uh, perform? <laughs> he says the secret is eating eggs. That's right. 82 years old, eating eggs is still going strong, Rosie. Joey, there's still hope That's for you. That's my next. dad, man. Uh, That's <laughs> my dad. So just yeah. back off. And, and Tommy, remind me to go out and buy 12 cases of eggs after I leave the show. <laughs> He'll need it. <laughs> really, I mean, Rosie. not my eggs. And stay away from my eggs. But I tell you one thing. <laughs> the guy's from Japan? Si. Who is he trying to kid? I mean, hello? He would never reach my eggs. That's a bell. hammer. Oh, man. That's more about you, I think, Mr. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so <laughs> all I can say is Mr. Miyagi is now my hero. Oh! oh. I'm so proud. But I think his other special ingredient was Placenta. Yeah. Oh. oh. Hey, Tommy, that's nothing. Where, I found an 80 from, year old female porn star who banged over a thousand men. Take a look. Oh. oh. Chocolate milk. Her tattoo says gangbang queen. Okay. Oh, okay. wow. I even have a picture of her with her boyfriend. He's only 31 years old. Oh. I got something better. How about a 92 year old exotic dancer and her boyfriend? It's ah. the same dude. Oh. He looks. He, he likes old bags, Tommy. Oh, that's disgusting. Yeah, yeah but yeah, oh, Tommy, God. wait, wait, wait. I'm, Rosie, you have a lot I'm of time a, on I'm your ashamed hands. of you, Rosie. Look, see me at the Fuego. Bring some class back to the show. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no, I tell you what. <laughs> they all ate the same placenta he was talking about. <laughs> no. yeah. They, they sprinkled it with so a lot of Viagra. Yeah. <laughs> and look, eggs, apparently. Look, first of all, 82 years old, still going strong. It's like the old Tomex watch. Takes a lick and keeps on ticking. Exactly. It's like a bionic but hip she's, in here, she's man. Proud of Do I get a belt back for that one? Give yourself a belt. Right, I got a belt for hey, that hey, one. Tommy, I'm, Tommy. I'm breaking even now. She's Tommy. proud of sleeping with over a thousand men. Joey does that in one month. Oh! Jeez, no one saw that coming, baby. It's pick on Joey night. It looks like your mom, actually. Oh. <laughs> 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 All right, so on to the next segment, these guys. Let's hit the next segment. Matthew Gidry, what's coming up? Hey everyone, later on we have Senorita Fuego and the Bigot Lottery, but next, uh, the American Circus featuring the professionals, only on Tommy's Garage! Healthcare system broken, the FDA broken, and the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com.
you locked your deadbolt. But this happened. Why? Because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins. You need armor, city, doors. There were over one million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone. But when deadbolts fail, armor, city, doors protects. Guaranteed. 713-487-5539 or stop by ArmorCityDoors.com. Remember, deadbolts do not stop kick-ins, but when deadbolts fail, you need Armor City Doors. ArmorCityDoors.com. We travel the highways and byways of America looking for the best stories we can find. Joining us are the professionals, yeah. Houston's finest entertainers, comedian Mike Rayo. Yeah. Mike! Yeah. 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 Funny man, Kuo and Gente! Rosie's so excited to see you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And filmmaker yeah. Joey Toronto! Let's get to an interesting Take story. Somebody did a little research on the Supreme Court. And guess what they found? The women on the Supreme Court get interrupted three times as often as the men. Mike, uh, you, look, you look kind of depressed, man. You okay? I am a little depressed. I haven't spoken to my wife in four days. Why? Why? I didn't want to interrupt her. <laughs> <laughs> that is... A double hammer. <laughs> women speak more than men. Women want to be heard more than men. Women interrupt. Hey, anybody here who's watched a movie with a woman gets the audio commentary. Oh, she was in my soap opera. Oh, I wonder what he was doing. Or does he look like your brother? That's the way things are. Get used to it. Everybody, that's why we're all different. It's no big surprise. Next. They get interrupted more because they talk more. Yeah, of course. Right. Go. Cool. Well, since I'm... I'm pretty much an expert in court cases and stuff like that. I'm black, so I'm actually happy about this kind of stuff. This is really good. So they cutting off. So basically, they cutting off women. They don't want women to talk. Basically, yeah. they interrupt a lot. Um, are they black? No, I want them. And I don't care about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need a new E. Oh no, you. <laughs> right. Well, you know uh, when the uh, five male members of the Supreme Court were presented with this fascinating information. Their collective response was, and your point is? <laughs> yeah, exactly. oh. That's a good one right there. Wait, 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 hold on a second. These liberal wenches, hold on a second. Sonia Sotomayor is about as sharp as a bowling ball. Right. Elena Kagan doesn't even know what the Constitution is. And someone please wake up Ruth Bader Ginsburg, right? <laughs> no, 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 keep her asleep. Inter 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 interrupt, yeah. them, interrupt them. Someone should slap those what they should do. From the Supreme Court to the Supreme Race, the Boston Marathon was held last week. Very challenging, especially on the anniversary of the Muslim bombing attack four years ago, right? So athletic company Adidas sent a warm email out to all the participants right here. It says, congrats, you survived the Boston Marathon. <laughs> Best taste, Mike. Whoa. No, no. Uh, as a fan, and this is called accidental insensitivity. As a fat man, this happens to me all the time. On the way over here tonight, I got pulled over by the police. Again? Happens to me too, Coop. Uh, they. You uh, black? I was wearing this white shirt, and they thought my airbag went off. So. Oh. <laughs> you know, it's funny because I actually read this article while drinking the Pepsi and on a flight on United Airlines. <laughs> <laughs> And I said, thank God I don't have Adidas because I'm an actual Puma guy. Yeah. <laughs> ah, there you go. Who haven't heard from for years? You know, I would just like to congratulate Adidas for surviving political correctness. Right. Ah, that's a good point. Uh, yes. But, you know, these guys, Adidas, they're not a, you know, a think tank. Uh, you think? Stuffed with sketchy, with guys, unemployable PhDs with sketchy opinions. They have to make money. So that's what I thought. Oh, look. That was bad, but it's not as bad as this one here we saw. Look, this one here says, Alter Boys, congrats, you survived the Catholic Church. <laughs> oh, right? yeah. Guilty. Oh, you yeah. just Guilty. didn't do that. Then they had another, one. Then they had another one a long time ago. It was like, to the Jews, what a oh. gas. You survived. <laughs> <laughs> that was really bad. Oh, that was yeah. really bad. I don't know. Ouch. Wow. A little insensitive, if you ask me. All right. In Oklahoma, I'm going to get my kick for that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In Oklahoma, 
A woman was sentenced to life in prison for murder? No. For dealing drugs? No. no. Worse, for dressing up as a witch and torturing her granddaughter. Oh, yes. Mike, would you do such a thing? What? Well, would I? Uh, <laughs> you know, probably not. I, I don't know now. They took the kid away, and uh, I don't know uh, who her new guardians are, but... I don't know how you cheer a kid like this up, but whatever you do, don't let her watch The Wizard of Oz. That's yeah, all I got to say. <laughs> exactly. You know what? Again, I'm just, I'm just, it just helps me because I'm black again. Like I'm saying, I'm watching what? this stuff going. <laughs> no. I'm watching this stuff going. White people are some crazy people, man. <laughs> yeah, because black people never do that. We don't do those stuff right. like that because we're too no. busy get drinking Pepsi and being United Airlines. Go <laughs> 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 about that a little bit. I like my witches in uh, leather and thigh high boots. With the really? belt. With and a hundred years younger, but. Yeah. Oh. But it really depends on how my Saturday night's going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm looking at this picture. I'm looking at this picture. Like something comes to mind. Here's the witch lady, right? It looks like and, Joey and, with glasses. Ah, oh, oh. Nancy. Oh. Do we have a Tommy's Bus match? Yes, we yeah. do. Yeah, we do. And finally in Florida, a pro tennis what? match. Why? <laughs> a pro tennis match was in the heat of battle. Well, somebody else came in the heat, apparently. It's a situation. A black tennis player. Whoa. What's up with that? Hello, friend. You hear in the background? Who? I still hear it. It's still going. <laughs> What is going on? It can't on? be that good! <laughs> <laughs> that guy gets a bell right there. <laughs> Mike, I'm not asking or anything, but like, does that sound, what's it sound like outside your bedroom window? Anything like that? Well, yeah, well, not, not really, but you know, I did listen. <laughs> if you listen to this carefully, it, it really, they think it was sex, but it was actually a mixed doubles match on the next court, and he accidentally uh, got his racket stuck in her net. And uh, she had to squeeze his tennis balls until the racket popped out, to which he screamed, it was an accident. And she said, don't you ever do that again. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. There's you write a that lot one? of metaphors yeah. in there, just yeah. in case you were wondering. Write that one in. Huh? Uh, I'll go back my ass up tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I want to congratulate Joey, by the way. Let's give him a round of applause for inventing the baseball cap tiara. Because that yeah. is <laughs> This is one of my biggest fans here. Thank you very much. We're gonna miss you, Mike. This is a very. This was a very interesting. Um, Story for me, Mike, because I was actually uh, on the plane to get a United Airlines drink of no. Pepsi. <laughs> no. <laughs> Come on. And I was playing with myself, actually. <laughs> <laughs> but I have to apologize because that was me making that noise. That was me doing that <laughs> stuff the whole time. Dude, it must have been great because they hear you from 30,000 feet. <laughs> and the best part about it, the guy was like this. She's faking him because he's hater. He's a hater. That's what they call a hater. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've heard of tennis elbow, but tennis oh. sex... I think I think the couple just decided that playing with two balls was a lot more fun than playing with one. There yes. you go. Yeah. Nice. I don't know, I like that. Like, <laughs> I don't know, that's that that's that you know more like sex, but like some balls were definitely getting smacked around for sure. You know, like <laughs> those two bed on up. But to me that sounds like somebody's getting some forehand, maybe some oh, FaceTime no. at the same time, all right? <laughs> what do you think? Matthew, what's coming up, buddy? Hey, remember folks, you can follow Mike Rayo on Twitter at Comedian Mike Rayo. You can watch Joey's new TV series about Joey on Amazon Prime. And you can catch Ku Ejinte at University of Houston Clear Lake on April 29th and May 5th at the Joke Joint. Next up, we got Senorita Fuego, only on Tommy's Garage. Yeah. locked your deadbolt but this happened why because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins you need armor city doors there were over 1 million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone but when deadbolts fail armor city doors protects guaranteed 713-487-5539 or stop by armorcitydoors.com remember deadbolts do not stop kick-ins but when deadbolts fail you need armor city doors armor city 
www.doors.com. Healthcare system, broken. The FDA, broken. And the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. No, okay, right. Look, just to remind everybody, I can't speak any Spanish, but Señorita de Fuego always interprets perfectly. Right, Señorita de Fuego? Sí, señor Tom. Yo voy a interpretar perfectamente tan pronto como usted deje de darme almuerzo las muestras, muestras gratis que dan en Costco. <laughs> it's a good thing you don't know Spanish. Yeah, I don't know yeah. Spanish, but sounds like, sounds sexy though. It's you know good what thing I mean? You don't turn around and look at the, uh, the TV. monitor. Oh, I, the only, I dare not look. And we have a Tommy's Garage supercomputer right here. It's a supercomputer interpreter, so you can follow along. So, are you ready to go see me the fuego? Sí. Yo siempre estoy lista para Tommy's Garage, señor Tom. Excellent. So here we go. Our first story. United Airlines has hired a new public relations team. United ha contratado nuevos relacionistas públicos y tenemos fotos. Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Dark. In Louisiana, a teenager was arrested for cursing near an elderly woman. Huh? Sí. Diciendo palabras malas alrededor de los mayores? Pero qué cara de mierda. <laughs> In, in Britain, a millionaire landlord banned colored people from renting his apartments because they smell like curry. <laughs> Wait a minute. Nada huele peor que el racismo. That's that's true, senor. That's right. That's right. That's right. Bueno. Excepto curry. Oh. <laughs> el curry realmente apesta. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you said, but you guys must have liked it. Yeah. In Austin, Texas, a new property owner discovered he had clogged pipes. The plumber discovered thousands of used condoms. They both discovered it was apparently a whorehouse. What's wrong with that? <laughs> Una buena puta siempre debe asegurarse de que las tuberías estén limpias. Oh! <laughs> In Mexico! An Easter play about Jesus was, was there a big play about Jesus, and an actor was playing Judas. He accidentally hung himself. Oh, oh. ouch! Si. Porque Jesús no perdona. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Richard Simmons is in the hospital. He's suffering from indigestion. <laughs> <laughs> Must be somebody he ate. Joey! You know what's in your tongue? I'm not going there. <laughs> That's way too easy. <laughs> I'm not going skip. there. We're going to skip the Simmons. <laughs> All Next! Right. Puerto Rico is apparently close to national bankruptcy. 
Oh, así que los puertorriqueños no trabajan en Puerto Rico tampoco. Lot, we got beaches. We got beaches. What are we going to work for? Yeah. Joey. Gonna, Joey. That's right. Puerto Rico, baby. Puerto Rico. They're going to kill me. Toyota has committed to investing $1.3 billion in Kentucky. Wow. Eso es más o menos mil dólares por diente. <laughs> Ouch. The, the, the human Ken doll visited Central Park. Why does he have breasts? Okay, three worst people and you know them. Yes! yes. <laughs> that was crazy. And last, and last, a new study shows that for every hour you run, you add seven hours to your life. Quizás. Pero por una hora bebiendo, te hace reír para siempre. Sí. There we go. All right. A lot of agreement on that one. Thanks for helping Tommy's Garage out with Hispanic Outreach Program, Señorita Fuego. Ay, señor Tommy, it was a pleasure to help you. Ah, uh, you know the pleasure is always on my Señorita Fuego. Of course. <laughs> Please. <laughs> like that's new. Not much pleasure as we're going to have with a bottle of wine after this show. Is that yeah. you? <laughs> what up? Come on, ladies! Hey, the fuego, everybody! <laughs> Matt D. Gidry, what's coming up next? Coming up, it's the Bigot Lottery, only on Tommy's Garage! Yeah! yeah. your deadbolt but this happened why because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins you need armor city doors there were over 1 million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone but when deadbolts fail armor city doors protects guaranteed 713-487-5539 or stop by armorcitydoors.com remember deadbolts do not stop kick-ins but when deadbolts fail you need armor city doors armorcitydoors.com healthcare system broken the fda broken and the pharmaceutical industry is not there to help you. How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Stop by EarthPatriots.com. Time for the Bigot Lottery. I hate this. I'm so bad at boom, this. Boom, boom. It's the Bigot Lottery. I hope that doesn't look like me. Yeah. Oh, you got to do the jazz. Yes, it's the Bigot Lottery every yes. week.
Because we find the biggest idiots who do the dumbest things and we force ourselves to guess the race of the idiot, thus embarrassing everybody in the process. Joining us is Rosie, Gavin, and Senorita Fuego. Hey. That's it? The white, the Hispanic, and the black. Yeah, I'm right. First, well, let's see the Oreo. scoreboard, Matthew. Anyway. We've got we've got tinfoil hat here standing at fourteen. <laughs> what? We've got Senorita Fuego sitting at fifteen, and Gavin is kicking their Bidens at twenty right now. Wow! That yeah. Is yeah. Awesome. Well, we only have two more shows to go until the, the, the spring quarter's over. So black you have two privilege. shows. We're gonna have to get rid of black, black privilege. privilege. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, does Gavin Babineau have to choke a bitch? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. So is my panel ready to go? Yeah. yeah. Is the audience ready to play the bigger lottery? Yeah. yeah. Let's play the bigger lottery in Florida. Why? 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 We'll see. A woman was, well, she was horny. She wanted sex, hot sex, heart pounding sex, hot and heavy sex, screaming sex, all night long, wake the neighbors, shout the driver up, blow the roof up, sex. The most amazing sex ever, only one problem. Her boyfriend didn't want to have sex. He wanted to sleep. <laughs> so she did what any woman would do. She kicked his ass. Literally, she gave him a whooping that Tina Turner would appreciate. Sent him to the hospital. $500 bond, white, black, Hispanic, or Asian, Rosie. Ooh. Wow, you know, Florida, you, you, you always think white right off the bat, right? We got a little bit of I'm sorry, I'm one. sorry, salty American. I'm sorry. Thank but you. this sounds like a black chick. Yeah. Okay, Rosie goes black. See, meet the fuego. Totally. See? Totally black. <laughs> One word. <Yeah>. Totally. <laughs> we, we don't fight for sex. My people, women. <laughs> oh, no, we don't. Gavin. <laughs> they don't have to, actually, the deal is. I'm shocked. What? Oh, and surprised. he's going to go black. Watch. Yes, yeah. he is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What do you guys think out here? White, black, Hispanic, or Asian? Black. 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 Crazy. Black. I'm black. going. Yo, no, I'm no kidding. Um, I think it's a crazy Anybody thing. think anything except black? Mexican. Well, one Asian and one Mexican. Okay, let's meet our babe with a barefooted beat down. Say hello to John oh. Ferguson. Oh. That cracker. You shit. get two confirmations here, white and Florida. So it's like, you know. All right, let's travel. You fooled me with that. Yeah, you yeah, know. He did. Let's travel to the other side of the country in California. Oh. A man stole a van. Not just any van. He stole a van from a mortuary. And you guessed it, it had a dead body inside. Oh. That didn't stop him for a little while. Then he came and he returned the van. <laughs> when he fan, he stole another van. Cops caught him two miles down the road. Black, white, Hispanic, or Asian? Rosie. I know. Uh, California stealing a van from a mortuary. Mm, rough one. Hispanic? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Hispanic? Maybe? There's a few Hispanics in California, a couple. aren't there? Well, wasn't that been bad boys they've been known for stealing things. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay, Rosie goes Hispanic. Send me the fuego. My people. That's <laughs> it. <Yeah. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> wait a minute, she was... She was giving me the stink eye, and now she says, now she says it's bad. With right. pride. With pride. <laughs> yeah, you know why we get, let them get away with it? Because they're great in bed. That's why. Oh, no. Like, you don't think so? <laughs> oh. Yeah. Gavin. Don't go there, Gavin. Oh, I have already been there. Oh. 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 Dang it. And went back and came back again. It, well, she certainly did. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no. I'm going, wow, this is not cool, because I was going to say the same thing, so. You can either extend the lead, uh -oh. you, you or you can uh, chance it. So I'm going to take the safer out and agree Hispanic on it. Oh, oh, look at him, he's going look, conservative. What do you guys think out here? Well, <laughs> who, says, who says Hispanic? It was too easy. Who says black? Who says white? Who says Asian? No, okay. Let's meet the hot rob of the dead body, Bobby Washington. Oh. <laughs> Just stick to your own. Yeah. I know it's yeah. the biggest thing. I lost the point, but I'm glad it's not Hispanic, right? Don't betray your race. Right. <laughs> and last, somewhere in America, a couple was married. Oh. But as happened sometimes, they were having a hard time conceiving. Sorry to hear that. But they really loved each other. They really did. So they had the same values, same sense of humor, yeah. liked the same people. They had a lot That's in common. A lie. True love. They really loved each other, you know? So, <laughs> so they went to the fertility clinic, and guess what they found out? Their brother and sister. Oh! oh. Turns out they were adopted. West Virginia. They were adopted oh, when they were kids and hadn't seen each other for who knows how long, and they just kind of like hooked up. And they, they had so much in common. How about that? Oh no! So now we got a brother and sister married, doing the nasty, trying to have a baby. So uh, we know they're a brother and sister. God. But from what state? Mississippi, Kentucky, <laughs> Florida, oh. or New York? That's Rosie. Gavin's going first. All right, Gavin goes Gavin's first. Gavin's going first on this one. Take it, Gavin. <laughs> 
Jesus Come on. Christ. Oh, hey, hey. You chill. Jesus has nothing to do with this one. Tell me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, screw it. New York. Yeah, wow, yeah. Gavin goes to New York. Boom, so you made the fuego. I'm going to take a, a gamble. Are you cheating here? You said what? You said New, New York. York. New York. I'm going to go away from him. What I'm going to go with the one with the many S's and the many PPs. <laughs> 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 And not to be outdone since I'm going last. Yes. I'm going to go with Kentucky. Yeah. yeah. Rosie goes Kentucky. What do you guys think out there? New York. New York. New York. I hear banjos. We're all over the place. Yes. Kentucky, yes. Kentucky, yes. Kentucky, yes. Kentucky. The theme song from the Lumber Just Play. So yeah. Yeah. Black yeah. Brown. Have a yeah. picture of them when they were little kids. You want to see it? Yeah. Take a look. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. I didn't decide to recreate the same picture. Take a look at this. Uh -oh. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Creep. That just kidding. I don't know who they are. Just some, <laughs> just some sick brother. You are a sick puppy, like Tommy. I I don't know, you are so sick. <laughs> yeah, he is yeah. yeah. sick. But do you have any more oh. pictures? Yeah. I found them on the internet. That's so sick. I want to see more. Matthew, how do we do? We did not do well. <laughs> we gained, Fuego gained one. Gavin's still hanging at 20. He's hanging all right. Tin yeah. foil hat is at 14. She's <laughs> now at 16. <laughs> wow. So go with well. it. How'd you guys do out here? Yeah. yeah, OK. Anybody get them all? Greg, you got all of them? Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, wow, all right. right. You so Matthew, let's hit that break, Matthew. <laughs> Tommy, let's ride this baby home with How to Fix America, only on Tommy's Garage. We are sick. I'm saying to myself. <laughs> you too. <laughs> I'm not getting in trouble because of him again. I'm getting proof he's not working. Come on, man, we gotta clean the pool. <laughs> what were you watching? It was so funny. I was watching the Bigot Lottery on Tommy's garage. Dude, you just made the Bigot Lottery. Ah! How can you give your body healthy, maximum performance naturally without all those chemicals and additives? EarthPatriots.com has found a natural solution. It's native to your body, crucial to your health. This product helps repair your cells and boosts your immune system, effectively slowing down the aging process. Welcome to EarthPatriots.com. Your deadbolt but this happened why because deadbolts do not prevent kick-ins you need armor city doors there were over 1 million kick-in robberies in 2014 alone but when deadbolts fail armor city doors protects guaranteed 713-487-5539 or stop by armorcitydoors.com remember deadbolts do not stop kick-ins but when deadbolts fail you need armor city doors armorcitydoors.com America. Well, I think when we build that wall all along the southern border, we build luxury hotels, theme parks, casinos all along there and make it a tourist destination to bring more tourists to Texas. I like that yeah. idea. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, Texas! That's all I got! That's, that's fine. <laughs> City of Fuego. That's 
I am gonna send Maxi Pad Waters to Mexico and ride the subway. Yeah. Hi. No, didn't work. Where Mike? I don't know. Go ahead, Mike. <laughs> well, personally, I think we should take all the money the Democrats are wasting trying to get these special election congressional candidates in, give it to the parents of those creaming kids, so the parents will have more time and money to pay for tennis lessons. Yeah. Oh, nice. 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 All right, I'll, I'll tell you, I want to fix America. I'll take a, a Donald Trump, Paul Ryan, and, and Mitch McConnell. I'm going to get them naked holding each other like those, like, like, like those twins were. I want to post it on Tommy's Garage webpage until they get rid of Obamacare. Yeah. Yeah. That's, how yeah. That's how I go to fix America. All right, that wraps up Tommy's Garage this week. Guys, have a good time. Yeah. 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 Let's thank the panel of Rosie Rosencrantz. Yeah. 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 The big man, Mike Grayo. Yeah. 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 Gavin Babineau. Yeah. 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 Joey Serrano. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right, you guys are the best audience in America. Let's hear it. Yeah! And I'm Tommy Yag. It's time to close the garage. We'll be back next week with another great show. So remember, pull up a chair, pop open that beer. It's time for Tommy's Garage, live from Houston, Texas. Let's hear it, baby! Yeah!